Hey y'all, welcome back. My name is Aisha Viadono. Come with me, get ready for a weekend in DC to go see my girl Glorella on her Anyways Life's Great Tour. I did do it with a few errands. I did a little packing, car wash, Chanel vibes. So get ready with me for a little staycation in the city. Welcome back to my channel. I am at the car wash and we're about to We're at the car wash. I'm about to clean out my car really quick. Hold on guys.
I just got a new set from Nail Bay LA. That's my girl. I did receive the wrong um, length for the French set that sits right underneath underneath the set that I was using. Um, I'm not upset about it, really. I mean, I did let them know, but I really don't feel like going through the whole process of sending it back and all of that. Like, I really don't care, but... Um, I love these nails. They're super high quality, super high class, baby. It's giving luxury. It gives... My nails are done every two weeks, honey. Let's not play these games. We have our top coat, which I just usually use like Miracle Nail and um, like a dry, a rapid dry top coat. And I'm just going to file that down because I actually did like a little manicure prior to this video um, because I had taken my previous set off um, before this because I had did my hair which you can kind of see it in this clip but not really but you'll see it in later clips um, I had already taken my nails off so that's why we're already at this point um, but I'm gonna shut up so that you can watch this part to explain what I'm doing here is I'm just applying that glue to each individual nail prematurely so that it can get a little tacky and so it won't take that long to um, adhere to my natural nail um, and when I pick the nail up in a second I'll show you how um, at that point I'm just moving the glue around getting it to every section of the nail that I needed to be at um, I don't really add any additional glue um, here you see me with the glue bottle up to my nail it's just really moving that glue around you see yeah, just moving that glue around and placing it like on the corners and on the edge of the nail so that it can you know have contact with every single piece of my natural nail and that's just the technique that I use most of the time there's extra glue so you see me wiping it away there with the q-tips um, you always have to have a Q-tip in the trash can close by because that glue, once you get it on the nail, it's a wrap. <laughs> it's going to look crazy. So you have to get that glue off as soon as possible. Here I just wanted to show you my technique of leaving the thumbs last because I just use the thumbs so often in the process of um, like pressing them to press on still and getting them firm on the nail so I just go ahead and do this step last um, and it works out for me um, it's just easier for me to be able to grip the nails and things like that when I'm picking them up when I do the thumb last see
we are all done and you know what happens next you gotta do too much because your nails is not girl that's let me see girl clap show me how you gonna clap at the concert show me how you gonna have your drink at the concert girl show me how you gonna get these tickets hey for okay show me how you gonna get them being burst honey show me what you're gonna do now go ahead and get that alcohol and make sure that you know you clean the base and everything off make sure there's no you know oils residue or anything like that left on your nails so that we can have a clean application wipe that glue bottle off so that that cap doesn't stick for the next time you do your nails I was ready for her. I was ready for my girl, Big Glow. All right, you know what time it is now. Let's give milk and honey cuticle oil. Yes, some nails are good too. This is probably my favorite set. I love the textile, reptile, girl, I don't know, print. <laughs> Not textile, but you know what I mean, bitch. <laughs> The reptile print. I'm assuming that's what this is. Like a little snake print vibe. Yeah. It's real cute. Real cute. Show me that gloss. Stop. Oh yeah, she was dead too. Big gloss. A big glow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But yeah, man. Okay, girl. You know we gotta type. You know we gotta show them how we gonna be. Get some more oil. That Glovilla is going crazy in the background. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I sound like uh, my father because I'm a little under the weather. I went to the doctor's office yesterday. They gave me a mask. And ever since then, I've been feeling like a crazy person. However, this is me en route to my staycation in Washington, D.C. I did stay at the AC downtown D.C. It was amazing. channel i have not got on this camera i have a new hairstyle clearly have a mullet going on i love that for us we have a full night plan um we are going to my girl big glows concert tonight and i'm on my way to go check into my hotel room in washington dc and I am excited for the night. It's gonna be lit. I am already doing a damn thing. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if I'm supposed to go through this light or not, but I don't think so. I'm definitely not going. <laughs> but um yeah. So yeah, it's gonna be a good night. I was gonna go out to dinner, but it was snowing, it's wet. I'm on my period. I'm just ready to so I can't I just want to lay down for a second I might because where I am I'm the hotel that I'm staying at is downtown DC and I feel like I want to go shopping a little bit and I want to see what's like in this area to where I can go shopping and just be around just for like Starbucks or something get a little drink and like I'll take a little because the concert isn't until seven so I do absolutely want to do something and I'm absolutely I want to put my car in valet but um i'm not sure how that's gonna go so i'm trying to also get there right now so let me come back to y'all when i get to the hotel so that i don't get lost that'll be great okay y'all so i am in the room this is me we're going outside tonight um this is the I see something scandalous. The windows. 
but it's giving construction, honey. So, not giving anything scandalous, but this is the room. This is really cute. This hotel is really, really swanky. I'm probably gonna go down to the restaurant in a little bit and see what they have. Smaller than, you know, the, I feel like this room is a little smaller than the one in Miami, for sure. Especially like the little nearest walkway area. But this is cute, honey. We are going outside. But we're gonna lay down for a second because baby, After almost oversleeping, it is time to get ready. It's time to get dressed for the night. Um, I did wear a Skims jumpsuit, and you're gonna see the main reason why I hate this jumpsuit. And it's the only reason why I hate this jumpsuit because why do companies put the zipper in the back? Like, we do have lonely girls out there that don't travel with many people or whatever the case. Like, why do companies put the zipper in the back and not on the side? Like, look at this. Granted, I'm a pro, but why do companies do this? Companies, please stop. Please, please, please. And Kim, it's no way. Well, I, I, of course, you have people to help you, but it's no way you're getting all that ass in that jumpsuit with that zipper in the back. Well, be fucking for real dropping my shit per usual show them the label girl I don't care what you do, never go out musty. Okay, honey, whatever you need to do, make sure them underarms is right. Yes, but yes, all of that. Make sure them wings is not flipping, girl, please. And honey, I go nowhere without my jewelry. I put on my jewelry just to go to the bodega. I put on my jewelry just to go out by the pool, okay? One thing about it, two things for sure, ho. Now this is where I start spilling all the tea. Wait till I take this scarf off and y'all see what's going on there. We already saw it in the first clip of me being in DC, but wait till I take this scarf off. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Get out of there, get out of there. This is where I start spilling tea, okay? This wig that I have on is an all trade wig prop wig in the color one, jet black. It was under $30 on Amazon. I will have it linked below please go get this wig yes i did style it in my own way i styled it cut it you know laid it down with styling foam um curled it with flat irons um probably i think probably like a one inch flat iron girl let me i'm gonna go show you the package right now go get this wig i'm buying another one as we speak girl from amazon it took no time to come to me it literally i ordered it probably tuesday and i needed it for friday and i got it on thursday 
Girl, stop playing. I was ready for the night, girl. Getting a tea. A tea is out. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right, now, what shoes are we going to wear? I wanted so badly to wear those heels. <laughs> I wanted to wear my, those boots so bad, but I had to throw my concert boots on, girl. Had to. Yeah, I'm just making sure, you know, it's looking good, making sure my butt was fat, making sure it could clap, making sure it could do everything I needed to do, you know. I did throw on my concert boots. Yeah, see, you gotta, when you throw an outfit, you gotta make sure you can do everything you need to do up in that outfit, okay? Even though it was a jumpsuit, you know, jumpsuit material can also be very stiff, but this was not, girl. I had me a good time. It was time to get out of the house. I was very, running very late, very, very late, yeah. Here you see me changing and see my concert boots. <laughs> Those are the self-proclaimed concert boots. I wear them to every single concert that I go to. Just in case I got to stomp a bitch, you know. But it will never be me. Because I will stomp a bitch in a fucking heartbeat with my concert boots. My number one tip. If when you're going to concert someone, get yourself a nice weapon boot. Okay? Something that you can stomp a hoe if you need to. And your good concert boot. Okay? Whether it's Doc Martens, it can be any old thing, girl, something with a nice heavy heel, okay? Just in case, you never know. When you are a part of the Skinny Mini Association, you have to make sure the body is bodying in a bodysuit. You cannot go out crazy in a bodysuit. Like, it can go real left, real fast, being a Skinny Mini. But these skins will have that body, that little skinny, extra, extra small body popping, okay? This bodysuit was a size extra, extra small, and it fit me perfectly. Um, I wouldn't change a thing about the bodysuit except for the zipper in the back, girl, like, because what? I did put on this thrifted leather jacket. It's 100% leather. And while doing research for this video for me to do, um, you know, put my links in the bio, I realized that I thrifted a $500 jacket for $20, and that's my definition of soft life, okay? You can never go wrong at the thrift store, honey. They gonna always have what you need for the price that you need it at. And I don't care how much money y'all think I got, I don't. <laughs> and I will always stay at the thrift store, honey. Now let's get the rest of this jewelry on because you know the look calls for an additional hoop. Yes, that makeup is sitting, honey. I did a nice little 90s look, which this is my usual look, really. This is a necklace that I got from Zara on sale. I thought it would be full price, but it was not. It was on sale, and I love her. That little pop up did everything it needed to do in my photos, which I will show you guys later. Girl, I look good. Hold on. Wait a minute. What is this giving? Is this giving Auntie? This is giving Auntie TT. Girl, it's giving very much Tiana Taylor. TT, is that you? Girl, stop playing. Now I'm going to go ahead and do this bag switch out. Um, I'm going to switch from my mini Louis Vuitton to this Zara rigid bag that I got a couple weeks ago. Um, I ordered it online. It was really cute and it gives a statement. It's really cute. If you guys want to to my bag video, please comment and let me know. Um, I mean, it's not too much that can go in this little tiny bag, but it gets crazy in there. So, please let me know if you do want that video. I will upload that for you all. is ready for the streets honey looking good feeling better baby it's a lot going on look great now we're in the uber on our way to the Howard theater where the concert is being held 
Everything that is good, much light, giving very much model, giving very much. We are outside, face sitting, face card never declines. We're getting our escort up to our seat. Um, I love the concert experience. I will always do a concert, girl. I will always do something. Right yeah. All right, got no loose. My girl, big glow. And at this point, I did not know that I had missed my girl gloss up. I was so upset about that once I realized. But yes, I was lit. God only knows what I was singing at this point. Um, I did have a shot at the hotel. So at this point, I was, yeah. I don't know what I was singing. <laughs> Hopefully, we're going to get a little clip of that later. Hold on. Let's see. Okay, so yes, it's a very appropriate song. Um, this song will have you lit at any given time. It does not matter where you are. It does not matter if you're in the car, on the bus, or a train, or a plane. And this song is going to have you lit, just like this. Singing at the top of your lungs, because what? See, at this point, no, it was bad. It, it, it yeah. We had a quick intermission and this is where the night really took a turn for the worst. Um, I had a great time but just went overboard it don't make no sense i am very much an auntie and i don't know who i thought i was this night but i was buying the pretty girl shots in the section like it's just i don't know what's going on i had a ball though i had a blaze my girl put on a show you can tell that she is really into her craft and she really loves what she does this girl put on a show for real like the concert wasn't that long but i had the time of my life i felt like i got my money's worth this girl is going to be big but well, she's already big but she's going to be big big i know we this girl did her thing like i had me a blaze at this damn concert <laughs> Bitch, first of all, I'm mad that I missed my bitch. So, oh, I'm real mad about that. Like, real mad about that, but we got her little post or whatever. I'm mad I missed my bitch. That's about it. Somebody got my Uber right now. I'm trying to see what's going on. What's see what's happening? Like, what's happening? What's on the streets? What's, look, what's going on? <laughs> she said she wants some Marvin Gaye, some Luther Vandross, a little Anita. I definitely set this party off right. What do we, what we, what we, what we? Well, she said she wants some ready for the world, some new addition, some mini ripple tins, and definitely set this party off for him. Would you be able to turn the heat on? Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> 
It is freezing. usually see like older people wearing like the leather jackets and stuff like that but it does not keep me warm no. <laughs> time like this is real went leather I went to the store and got 100% leather and it does not it does not keep me warm no 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 it does not keep me Yes, I'm absolutely. You need the summer clothes, yeah? You know, I'm just a a a, a tropical being. You know, I just don't. We're supposed to be in the tropics. We're not supposed to deal with these types of conditions <laughs> at all. Have you been busy tonight? Uh, no, no complaint. No, that's good. I think it's good because you are here. Yeah, that's good. I don't know. I'm got, no, I'm going to get to where I need to be I safely. Got a good customer now. The that's last good. time. Yeah. That's I'm good. Sorry, no that's good. concert tonight so I'm sure you'll be busy. There was a lot to like going on. You know it's like the basketball tournaments and stuff like that too. Take that motherfucking makeup off. Because in the morning, you're gonna be the bitch that say, Oh, why the fuck you bitches say, Help me say my makeup off? <gasps> Take that motherfucking makeup off. I am drunk. If I could tell you, I'm, I could, if I could show you what's going on right now, and how drunk I am, <clears throat> take that motherfucking makeup off. Take the fucking makeup off. Even if you just do this, <clears throat> that shows you how drunk I am. Even if you just take a fucking makeup wipe to your shit, fuck the whole washing pressure. Take a fucking makeup wipe to your shit, at least. Bitch, take that motherfucking makeup wipe off. Mm. Bitch, bye. 
of course I have to show you all the content made in this space. Here's my get ready with me that is posted now on my Instagram page, slimkiller underscore. That is S-L-I-M-K-I-L-L-A underscore. And we are lit over there on Instagram. We have a great feed going on over there. So if you want to come and be a part of the gang, come over there and follow us. We are not private because girl boo. But come follow us. We lit over there. Titties are fat, my stomach is flat, and I'm the baddest bitch. And bitches don't hate, get with the motherfucking pro. And now we are on our way home. There was no traffic, I had to give me a little wah wah before I left. Um, wah wah was right across the street from the hotel, so I had to go and get me a sandwich and a little chicken noodle soup because the night before was crazy. All in all, I had a great time on my staycation. It was a beautiful stay. Hotel was amazing, great and swanky, honey. If you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching and come back again soon. Remember, follow me on Instagram and we'll be back.